What's going on YouTube? I am back with another video and in this one we have Obsidian Basketball. So this is the uh, hobby version, not the first off the line version. This released today, which today is Wednesday the 17th. So I have seen a decent amount of the first off the line boxes ripped on YouTube and those do seem pretty decent. I believe the, the going price on those is around like $500 to $600. The regular hobby box is quite a bit cheaper coming in around uh, you know, depending on what your hobby shop might have it at in between like 300 to 350, uh, which is pretty much what I got mine at right in the middle there. So um, the past couple years, I have actually not ripped Obsidian. I believe I was kind of going back through my channel because I wasn't sure if I honestly had ever ripped it. But in 2018-19, uh, which was uh, like Luca, Trey Young, I did actually rip a box of Obsidian Hottie obsidian hobby uh so the two years after that i skipped it and then this year i decided to rip it again because um it's come down a little bit in price uh, you know again a little bit over 300 dollars. you do get seven cards per box so it's a little bit high risk high reward but not crazy and uh from what i've seen from the first off the line boxes which you know they do have additional you know guarantees over the hobby boxes uh they do seem pretty decent so decided to give this uh decided to give obsidian a try this year so should be a pretty quick rip and uh, i believe that's pretty much all the information i needed to uh get out so let's go ahead and hop in um, not sure if I'm going to have a video tomorrow, uh, but uh, Optic Football H2 does come out Friday. So probably going to rip a box of that. Um, so uh, yeah, just wanted to mention that. Be on the lookout on Friday. Uh, likely going to have Optic H2. It should be a pretty fun rip. Um, so out of the Obsidian Basketball box, we are looking for two autographs. Uh, typically, it's going to be one decent to like good auto and then it's going to be one that's maybe worth like a dollar to five dollars so uh the two autos is not really that great of a guarantee with a product like obsidian because one is probably not going to have a lot of value at all um and then if you guys want to take a look at the back of the box all the you know different parallels and inserts and stuff uh that you can find in here you can screenshot that so um yeah we're looking for top rookies like um you know the guy on the cover there evan mobley scotty barnes kate cunningham uh you know since i did go ahead and trade my Cade Cunningham, one of one that I pulled at the National. Would love to pull another Cade that I could actually keep in the PC. Uh, so we'll see if we can get lucky here. Um, you know, my, my luck with this year's class has not been that great. Uh, you know, when, when ripping hobby boxes, I guess the, the National packs don't necessarily count. Uh, but as far as like hobby boxes, my luck with this year I haven't really pulled too many bangers, so hopefully we can turn it around with Obsidian here. And it does feel like kind of a thick pack here. I don't know, um, you know, what the standard packs feel like, but I believe we're gonna have, um, you know, a couple base cards up front, maybe an insert and a base card in the back, and then the auto should be in the middle. So let's just go ahead and see what we have up front. And we're gonna start, start with a random one. I would not have guessed uh, I would pull an Isaiah Thomas out of here. Um, but we're going to start with Isaiah Thomas and yeah, I have absolutely, I'm going to take a quick look at, uh, what we're looking at here. So yeah, I think our two autos are going to be in the middle and there is a super, super thick card, uh, in there. So we'll maybe pull like one or two from the top here. So there's a look at obsidian. I do think it always looks, you know, pretty nice, but it's, you know, not my favorite product for sure. Uh, but pretty cool with the background, kind of like the, um, the crowd and the other players are like just the outlines or whatever. So uh, pretty cool. Isaiah Thomas, that's just the base, not going to be numbered. And then next up, we are going to have uh, Miles Turner. So another base card. So I believe maybe we have like three base cards up front. So let's actually go from the back because the next one's going to be Dominique Wilkins. So, so far, uh, not pulling any rookies. And we're going to have, I believe this is going to be a tunnel vision on the back. And we are going to have a Chris Paul tunnel vision. So that one is gonna be numbered and that one is 98 of 99. So, so far not the best box. <laughs> Let's see what we have. Hopefully this will be a rookie right here and it is going, going to be an orange. And it is DeMar DeRozan, wow. So we uh, did not get a strong rookie box. We have zero rookie so far. And the orange is gonna be numbered to 50. So that is, uh, I believe that's seven of 50. That zero is kind of like messed up there. Uh, but seven of 50 on the DeMar DeRozan. And um, 
One thing I'm noticing on these cards, actually the tunnel vision looks pretty good, but the other ones like the base and the parallel, they're all off center. So centering definitely gonna be kind of tough on these. And let's go ahead and I guess we'll just pull from the back here. It's this, we're, the next two cards are gonna be our auto. So hopefully we get a rookie on at least one of these. Um, and that is gonna be a rookie jersey, HJ. Oh, uh, man, I have no clue. Pelicans, Herbert Jones, and that is going to be to 35. So it's not looking like we got the best box here unless we got another rookie auto here. So Herbert Jones on the RPA uh, is going to be on a sticker, just a napkin uh, patch there. And again, to 35 on the Herbert Jones. And our next auto, I'm guessing it's probably going to be a vet. Usually, I don't think you really get two rookies. Uh, it's going to be... V-S-J-H-T. Uh, yeah, I have no clue. Volcanic of Josh Hart. And man, what a brutal, brutal box. Jeez, okay. Uh, Volcanic Josh Hart, and that is another one to 35. So Josh Hart for the Trailblazers. And uh, yeah, I mean... That's, that's kind of what you can expect with, uh, expect from Obsidian. There's going to be some really good boxes. There's going to be some not so good boxes. Unfortunately, we got a not so good box. But uh, again, that's just kind of the way it goes sometimes. So, uh, you know, on this channel, we're going to upload the good and the bad. We're not going to rip a bunch of boxes and, uh, you know, upload the, uh, the best box like some other channels out there might. So real quick recap, we got Dominique Wilkins, DeMar DeRozan to 50, I guess... Uh, I, well, I was going to say that might be the best card, but I guess the Herbert Jones RPA, uh, Chris Ball, Tunnel Vision, Miles Turner, and Isaiah Thomas, and then uh, the Herbert Jones RPA. So again, a little bit over 300 on that one, maybe got back like 50 bucks. So a uh, pretty big L there, uh, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. Again, I do plan on ripping a box of Optic H2 on Friday. So be on the lookout for that one and uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you soon.